everyone and welcome back. So today I'm doing one of my favorite videos, which is an all blind bag video. I absolutely love blind bags. If you guys have been watching, you know I love to do the blind bags. So we have about 15 different ones here to open together today. And as always, I am super excited to see what we get. So I'm gonna start down here on our bottom shelf. We'll work our way up and I'm gonna go right for the Yummy World Snack Attack because there's nothing I like better than a good snack. So on the back here, it shows all the different little snacks you can collect. Sometimes I have a little trouble identifying what they are and you guys are always super helpful. So let's see what we get. Hopefully I'll know what it is. <laughs> oh, I totally know what this one is and it's one of my favorite snacks. It is a bowl of salsa and a tortilla chip. Oh my gosh, you think it's mild or spicy? What do you think? How cute is this one? This is actually a really kind of a bigger one too of these like little snack attack keychains. Super, super cute. It comes with a little silver key ring and I just think these are fun, awesome little collectibles, right? Look how big that one is, holy moly. Ah, I don't think he's gonna stand up straight because he's a bowl. <laughs> All right, it looks like we're gonna do this one next. This is the, I need a deep breath for this one. Disney Whisker Haven Tales with the Palace Pets. It's a pop and stick mini surprise from series two. That is a mouthful. So it shows in the back there's eight different ones, uh, eight or ten or nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different ones to collect. They're really cool. They have these little pop out cardboard like displays and then you get to suction cup your little character right onto it. Pretty sure I need a scissor to get into this one. All right, so this is the little display stand. So you pop out all your pieces. Pop, pop. Ooh, that looks delish. That's like a little pie and a little drink, I guess. All right, I gotta figure out how this one works. I think it's gonna go this way. So you pop your little like accessories or whatever you wanna call them onto here. And let's get our soda or our drink of water in there like that. Right, let's look at the back, see which one we have, that'll help me. I never got this one before, this is awesome. So it looks like we got Sweetie over here. We'll cut her out. And it also comes with an accessory along with your palace pet. It's just like a little trophy, right? Yep, it's a little trophy, super cute. As you see, it has a little suction cup under there. And here is Sweetie. Oh my gosh, she is so pretty, right? Absolutely beautiful. And she also has a little suction cup. And you can suction cup them right onto our little display here. Let's see if I can get it to stay on there. This is a small one. Usually they're kind of bigger than this. I'm gonna put it down and try. Oh, okay, so her suction cup is not working really well. And they usually work super, super good. Look, I can't even get it to suction cup to the desk. Let's try the trophy here. I think that one's working a little bit better. All right, so you see how that one's stuck on there? Usually both pieces stick on really good, and it's a little like display for our palace pet. They are really very, very cute. I wish she would stick for me. I don't think I'm even going to get her to stand up. We'll put her back here like this. Anyway, you guys get the idea. Okay, all right. Next blind bag comes from Pine Size Heroes. These are really, really nice collectibles. These come from Funko, I believe. Yes, they do. And this version is the Disney Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Shows in the back all the different ones to collect, and there's no rare or common or ultra rare in this. They all have, you have an equal chance of getting each one in every blind bag. Okay, so we got one of the dwarfs. Do you guys know which one this is? I stink at my dwarfs. I have no idea which one this is. The collector's guide does not show their names. Let's see. I'm going to guess that this is Dopey. What do you guys think? If you guys have been watching the Seven Dwarfs, I've seen it recently, let me know if I'm right. Leave me a comment. I think I might be Dopey. I think I might be right on this one. Hmm. Yeah, with the, looking at all of them, I think this is Dopey. All right, guys, let me know if you know. Either way, super, super cool. All right, next we have a Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles um, blind bag. This is a series three. It shows in the back the different ones to collect. Let's get in here and see what we have. This is from Mega Block, so I'm going to have to build our Ninja Turtle or our character. Oh my gosh. I feel pieces. Okay, it looks like it does come with a collector's guide maybe or just directions. Let's open it up here. Yeah, we got some directions on how to build. And oh, there's a mystery one that you can try to get as well. 
And there's even like secret rare, ultra rare, rare, or common. So let me put them together and we'll see who we have. All right, so check this guy out. Look at his eyes and his mouth. They're pink. It's so weird. He looks really, really scary. I don't know what this character's name is. He's not one of the regular Ninja Turtles. So again, if you guys know who this is, let me know. I think he's super cool. He's right here on the collector's guide. He's got the little blue symbol, which means he is a common one for this series. But he is really, really awesome. Let's see if he stands up. Yay, he's standing up. Woohoo! Next, we have a, a Shopkins Micro Light Surprise from Series 1. Aw, oh, it looks like we got Cheesy. <laughs> He's that delicious wedge of cheese. Has the little light on the bottom. You give him a squeeze. <gasps> oh, no. I hate when this happens. Aw, I think we got a dud. Sometimes if you bang these guys, they light up for you. But I think he's a dud. Oh, that stinks. Well, normally it lights up, and it's usually a really, really pretty color, but we're not going to see it today. Aw, that's a bummer, right? But either way, still super cool. Comes with a little hole here, so you can use it, like, as a charm as well. Let's go up to our second shelf. Our next one is a puppy in my pocket. This one is a Series 8 a little collectible. Adorable little puppies. Oh my gosh, how cute is this one? <gasps> he's got a little shirt on. What is he? Do you think he's a bulldog? I think he might be a bulldog, guys. He is so cute. And this one's like really soft. They all have like um this like furry material on them that makes them feel like, you know, like a real dog would. But this one is like really extra super soft. Let's see who he is. I've never seen this one before. So, oh, it is. It's Baxter, and he is an English bulldog. How adorable. Oh, my gosh. They are super cute. They make the cutest of little pets. Everyone thinks that they're, like, scary, but they're nice. They're really, really, really super, super friendly little dogs. Actually, they're not so little, I guess. <laughs> oh. Okay, uh, next one is a, oh, my gosh, Disney Pixar Cars 3 mini races. Little um, racer cars, basically, from the movie. Super cool. Now, I thought this came with a guide. Yes, it does. It's right here. Here's our collector's guide. It looks like we got Chick Hicks, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, check it out. There he is right there. And these are really cool. They're regular little, like, mini cars, and they actually race around. They're just kind of like little miniature versions of the cars. Really, really cute. Let's go to our LOL light up surprise. These are so cool. If you're an LOL fan, you gotta like these. Um, not only am I an LOL fan, but I love the light ups from Bullseye Toy. Shows in the back all the different ones to get. You can find these in Target, guys, if um, you're looking for them. Oh, who do we get? Who do we get? Oh, awesome. So you get your dangler. You get the um, checklist, which is new for these. You don't usually get that. And we got Leading Baby today. And these ones are extra special because they come with two lights. There's one down here by this hand, and then her other hand points up, and there's another one up there. Let's hope our lights work. They do. Give her a squeeze, and both sides will light up simultaneously, which means at the same time. Gives you the little dangler, so you can attach it to your backpack, take it wherever you like. And they also include this little sticker sheet, which is really, really cool. But the extra special thing about this is it glows in the dark. There are words on here. I can't remember exactly what they are, but I'll turn out the lights and we can read it together. Lights out, and it says, always ready for a selfie. Already, always ready for my selfie. <laughs> Super cool, right? You would never even know that there were words there until you turn out the light. And our next blind bag comes from My Little Pony. This is a little mini figure collection. There is a gold um, Pinkie Pie to try to get. It's a 1 in 24 chance to get it. The rest are here on the back. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, I guess 9 in all to collect. And these are like um, a metallic version, so they're actually really cool and super shiny. Look how pretty. See what I mean by the metallic? They're so shiny. So here we have... Um, Applejack, right? And it comes with this super cute display stand, which I think I really, really like. So you pop it into the side there, and then the bottom goes into the stand. How nice is that? Says little My Little Pony right there on the stand. I think these are really, really cool. Very, very cute. 
All right, next. Oh my gosh, you know how much I love these. If you've been watching any of my blind bag videos, I love the Hello Kitty costume collection. It is a series one. I don't know if there's a series two. I wish they would come out with it. I've looked forward. I can't seem to find it. Shows all the different Hello Kitties to collect in all these super fabulous costumes. And there are two rare figures that are mysteries to try to get. Wait to see. They're so nice. <gasps> Whoa, guys, we got a mystery one. Holy moly. This is so cool. So this is one of the rare ones. The regular ones are really, really super nice. I almost wish I had one of those to show you because they are fabulous. But this is the mystery one. I, I don't know what she is. I, I don't know. I, an alien? I don't know. She's all green. She's got a big bow coming out of the top of her head in addition to the one that she always wears. Sparkly, glittery, fabulous. But I'm not quite sure what she's supposed to be other than like really really cool that's crazy i can't believe i got the rare one that's always a good time right all right let's move up here to our next one which is a my little pony this is i believe wave 24 from the movie let's see what we have oh look how pretty this is maud rock pie and it says her sisterly sisterly love brings friends together look how pretty she is all in like lavender lilac I love her cutie mark. It's like a, a, a gem or a diamond. Wow, she's fabulous. Very, very cool. Definitely don't have that one yet. All right, so up here we have a Mega Constructs, a little bit more building for me today. This one comes from Despicable Me 3. It is a Series 11. Holy moly. So they have a lot of these um, blind bags out there for you to get. Let's see what we get. Looks like there's a mystery one, right? Okay, so here's all of the pieces. It does come with a collector's guide. I'm going to put it together and we'll check it out. All right, so and check out the one we have. I absolutely love this guy. His sign says, what for lunch? <laughs> that is a very popular question around my house. I don't know if it is around your house, but it's also what's for breakfast? What's for dinner? I hear that question a lot around here. Ah, I dropped him. All right, let's check him out on our collector's guide. Here he is right here. So he is a common um, minion or character for this collection. Down here at the bottom or at the back, it has the rare one, which is our uh, Unigoat. And then the secret one, which is a mystery, but it looks like it is a minion. All right, his sign fell down here. Let me get that and we'll move on. All right, there we go. It's so funny. What's for lunch? It makes me laugh. All right, next we have an Animal Jam blind bag. I love these. I don't know if you guys have seen me open them. This is a deluxe trading card blind bag, and it comes with 14 trading cards and an Animal Jam figure. Now, not only are these, like, super cool collectible cards, but they are really informative absolutely educational like this one here is a koala you flip the card over and it tells you these super cool facts about the koala it tells you the size they are the weight they are their conservation status this one says least concern which is a really good um status they tell you their diet what they eat kind of a little bit about where they live and then these really fun facts about the animal this one says koalas are most famous for only eating the leaves of the eucalyptus tree then only in Australia, these unique marsupials are most active at night. And they're absolutely adorable to boot. All right, let's see what else we have. We have a panda, and again, all the different um, facts about them. The beautiful Arctic wolf. We have some snow leopards, which are fabulous. A rhino. A fox, what a cutie. Oh, another koala. Oh, fabulous, a flamingo. I love flamingos. A hyena. A llama. This is a puzzle card, so you can try to collect. Oh, we got two of them. You can try to collect the different cards and um, complete the puzzle, which is really cool. Here we have a lemur. Those are really, really awesome. Um, and here is a coloring card, so you even get to um, possibly color. Here is our figure. Get a little figure, and you get a little accessory to go on your figure. Look, it's so cute. It's like a little elephant. Isn't that adorable? And it's like a little purse on its head. <laughs> so these are really cool. Even if you're not a fan of the um, actual video game, I just think the cards are so, so cool. All right, let's move up here to our next one. These are really cute. This is the um, Ring Pop Puppies um, bonus pack. You get two of them in here, which is really, really cool. And the little wearable ring. So it looks just like your candy Ring Pop, but hidden inside is a puppy. 
Oh, what a cutie. So check out this little guy, pink and green. And then it's, it's a bonus pack. Oh, I thought it was the same one. I was like, what? That never happens. But they do look very similar. Also with the pink and the green. Look how cute. But he's got white face and this guy's got a green face. Absolutely adorable. Now these have um, names. There is a collector's guide running around here somewhere. Here it is. Let's see if I can find them. I love their little names. They're so cute. All right. So this guy with the little green patch on his head. Where are you? Maybe on this side? Is this him? No, I think that's the other one. Where are you? Hmm. I don't really see him. It looks like Melly right here because it has like the same white patch and it's pink. But it doesn't have the green patch on the head. And this one doesn't have a green patch either. And here's Pluck. That has the white patch. I have no idea who this is. Doesn't really, really match that well, does it? Look for limited edition. Oh, is it? No, it's not Green Berry or Red Nico. I am totally confused. All right, let's see if we can find this guy. So pink with the green face was on this side. So this is Wooly. All right, he was easy, easy to find. But this guy, I'm not so sure. I did the checklist. Doesn't exactly match the puppies too well. But either way, they're super, super cute. All right, let's see if I can get these up here. I'm running out of room. All right, I just had to switch hands. And our next blind bag is our Thomas and Friends minis. These are super, super cute. Contains one engine, and I think there's a checklist also. I like this um, series. It's really, really cute. So check it out. Look at this. This is Stanley, but he's got like apples on him. How cool is that? They're real working little trains, so they're definitely collectibles, but you can also play with them, which is probably the best kind. So where is our Apple Stanley on here? Probably just says Apple Stanley. Yep, it does. It is Apple Stanley. <laughs> they are really, really cute though, right? Especially if you're a Thomas fan. All right, guys, so that's it for our blind bag surprises today. As always, we got some really, really super cool stuff. It's awesome that we got the rare Hello Kitty. That was fabulous. All right, guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me and checking this all out today. Be sure to come back. Don't forget to subscribe to see lots more toys and surprises every single day here with me on Cam's Toy Box. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you real soon. Bye.